Hi, I want to use these wooden posts to make the Leonardo da Vinci's self-supporting bridge. That bridge is something similar to this. These pieces give the curved shape to the bridge. And these horizontal pieces help to keep everything in place. So I must decide how long I will cut these pieces and how long I will cut these pieces. In this mock-up we can see these two pieces here. Next two pieces begin between the first one. The next two pieces are in the outside. Then two in the inside. And then another two in the outside. But in the real bridge I must put the first two pieces. Then the next two pieces begin between the first ones. And then another two pieces that begin in between the last ones. So the length of these pieces will be the length I want them to protrude to the side of this wooden bridge. Plus two times the width I have here. Plus the width I want in the middle of the bridge so I can cross it. In this case I have two pieces here. But in the real bridge I'll have three pieces here. So the length of these pieces will be the length I want them to protrude here. Plus three times the radius of one post. Plus the distance I want to have in the middle of the bridge. Plus once again three times the radius of one post. And plus the distance I want them to protrude here. So I must keep in mind that I will have three pieces here. Like this. So I want them to protrude 10 cm here. Then I'll have three times the diameter of one post. And then the width I want in the middle of this wooden bridge. These posts are 6 cm in diameter. So three posts are 18 cm wide. Say 20 cm. I want them to protrude 10 cm. So 20 plus 10. I'll have 30 cm in this side of this wooden bridge. Plus another 30 cm in the other side of the bridge. Then I have 60 cm. And I want something like 40 cm in the middle of the bridge. So the posts will be 60 plus 40 is equal to 1 meter long. Now the problem is that if I cut them 1 meter long, then I cannot get two pieces out of one post. So I will cut them 90 cm long. Now let's see how long I will cut these pieces. These are the pieces that will give the curved shape to the Leonardo da Vinci's bridge. And the length will be... Well, I just want the bridge to look nice. So like this, I think there will be too much distance between the horizontal pieces. And like this, they will be too near. But like this, I think they look nice. Like this, that end protrudes between 5 and 7 cm. And they can also protrude between 5 and 7 cm in this side. So like this, this pieces will be 110 cm long. Then, I need to cut 5 horizontal pieces that will be 90 cm long. And I also need to cut another 10 pieces that will be 110 cm long. So I will make Leonardo da Vinci's bridge in next week video. And in that video I will make a drill press jig to cut the notches in the right place in each post. I will make a jig because the distance between the notches must be exactly the same. And the notches must be perfectly aligned. Like this, if all the pieces are the same length, they are all the same diameter. The distance between the notches is the same and they are perfectly aligned, I suppose all the pieces of the wooden bridge will fit together. 
The problem now is that, despite I can cut perfect notches with a drill press jig, it happens that the posts I have are not perfectly straight, and if the pieces I will use are not straight, they won't fit together. So the 2 meters long posts are quite straight. But the longer posts have some curve that I must avoid. So I must measure and cut the post to get the most stripe pieces. For example, there is a small curvature in the end of this post, so I will cut it here. And I measure 110 cm, more or less here. And here I have another curvature. A couple of posts have some deep cracks from one end to the other. So I won't cut any notch in these ones because that could weaken them. But I can use them to make the horizontal pieces because I don't have to cut notches in the horizontal pieces. And despite the deep cracks, I think they will support my weight. So now I just have to cut some more pieces. In next week's video I will make the drill press jig to cut the notches. And we'll see how to assemble this wooden bridge. Thanks for watching. You can find all my woodworking videos in my channel in YouTube. If you like my videos don't forget to like and to share them. And thanks for subscribing to my channel.